Hello. Scorpy 6 represents number 6. Scorpy 6 is a scorpion who uses his sting to frighten others. Remember my trick. You only have to memorise the stories that start with the smallest number. What's the story of one times six? Mrs. Wonderwand can't help playing tricks on her friends. <laughs> when she comes across Mr. Scorpy Six, she casts a spell and changes him into Scorpy Six Clown. One times six is six. Remember my trick. You only have to memorise the stories that start with the smallest number. What's the story of two times six? When two squeaks sees Scorpio six the Scorpio, she is frightened he will sting her. She is terrified and runs away. She scurries down a mouse hole and hides behind a wall in the shape of a one. Uff, two squeaks are safe at last. <sighs> two times six is twelve. Uh -huh. Remember my trick. You only have to memorise the stories that start with the smallest number. What's the story of three times six? When Frankenstein meets Scorpy Six, the Joker, he expects the worst. Scorpy Six does indeed have a new idea to tease poor Threakenstein. He stings him and shakes him like a bottle of soda. The pressure blows the top of Threakenstein's head off in the shape of a one. Followed closely by his brain springing out in the shape of an eight. Yuck! Three times six is eighteen. Uh -huh. Remember my trick. You only have to memorise the stories that start with the smallest number. What's the story of four times six? When vamp four sees Scorpy Six's tasty tail. He can't help taking a bite out of it. Furiously, Scorpy Six hits him with his tail. Bumpful flies through the air and lands on a tombstone, which he breaks in the shape of a two. Four times six is 24. Remember my trick. You only have to memorise the stories that start with the smallest number. What's the story of five times six? When Flaming Five sees Scorpy Six going by, he wants to tame him. He gets out his whip and he cracks it in the shape of a three and breathes out a flame to light the magnificent ring of fire in the shape of a zero. Aha, uh -huh. so who's the strongest now? Five times six is 30. What's the story of six times six? When Mr. Scorpy Six meets Mrs. Scorpy Six, they give each other a big kiss and a heart flies out. As it touches the ground, the heart breaks in the shape of a three. And an adorable baby Scorpy Six appears. Six times six is 36. What's the story of 
6 times 7. When Scorpy 6 meets the mummy ram 7, he pulls on her bandages with his stinging tail and changes the poor mummy into a spinning top. Very pleased with the trick he has just played, he laughs very loudly. Then, seeing a beautiful cactus in the shape of a four, Scorpy Six throws the bandages onto it. They stick on in the shape of a two. Six times seven is 42. What's the story of six times eight? When Scorpy Six meets Spooky Eight, he can't help playing a trick on him and lifts up his sheep. Poor Spooky Eight suddenly feels a draught. Feeling very embarrassed, he hides behind a cactus in the shape of a four and makes himself some clothes out of thorns and flowers. Oof, Spooky Eight has regained his shape of an eight. Six times eight is 48. What's the story of six times nine? When Scorpy Six meets Slimy Nine, he wants to sting him with his tail. But Slimy Nine is quicker and hides under the ground. Scorpy Six doesn't give up though and tries to reach him at the end of his tunnel. But he comes out with something hanging off his tail. It is a cow's skull in the shape of a five. He is very disappointed and gets rid of it behind a cactus in the shape of a four. Six times nine is fifty-four. What's the story of six times ten? When Scorpy Six meets the potion Magi Ten, it makes him very, very hungry. He dives headfirst into the cauldron and comes out feeling very full. He gives an enormous magic burp and blows a bubble in the shape of a zero. Six times ten is sixty. <laughs>